Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Shadow here with a brand new video and in today's video we're going to be looking at Symphony's settings. So as usual we're going to start off with his mouse settings, then we're going to move on to his keybinds and then after that we'll end the video off on his video quality settings. Now looking at his mouse sensitivity, his X sensitivity is set to 9.9% and his Y sensitivity is set to 9.9%. For his mouse targeting sensitivity, it is set to 5.5% and for his mouse scope sensitivity, it is set to 5.5% as well. Now moving on to his mouse DPI, it is set to 400. Now that's pretty much all his mouse sensitivity and settings. Now moving on to his keybinds, use is mouse wheel up, jump is spacebar, reload slash rotate is R, sprint is left shift, crouch is C, Repair slash upgrade is mouse wheel button, harvesting tool is X, weapon slot 1 is 1 and so on which is standard, and then weapon slot 5 is Z, wall is V, floor is Q, stairs is mouse button 5, roof is mouse button 4, trap is T, building edit is F, inventory is tab, map is M, and uh, place trap is T. And that's pretty much all his keywords. Now moving on to his video quality settings, he plays on full screen at a resolution of 1920 by 1080 and he caps his FPS around 230. Now looking at his view distance, it is set to near, shadows is turned off, anti-aliasing is turned off, textures is set to low, effects is set to low, post-processing is set to low, v-sync is turned off and motion blur is turned off. So he pretty much has all of his settings either set to low or off because he wants to get that extra bit of juicy FPS and get an advantage over other players. Now he has his brightness set to 0.56 and his colorblind mode set to uh, protonope and the strength is 10. So that's pretty much Symphony's settings and uh, sensitivity and keybinds. Hopefully you found this video useful. Smash like and uh, peace.